This is local edition Brad Pomerantz here in Glendora, the San Gabriel Valley, and we're joined by Brian Miller. He is with LA County's Department of Children and Family Services, working in Glendora, actually. I want to get a sense from you, what is the work, what's the focus of DCFS? We are the uh, child welfare right. agency for LA County. Um, we are the ones who receive the calls um, of alleged abuse and neglect and do the investigations uh, to, to see if there is a child who does need some assistance. Um, ideally, um, if we investigate and feel that we can keep the child in the home safely, providing services to the family in the home, that's our first goal. Right. What about with a relative? Is that always, I guess, the second goal? Yes, if, if a child has to be removed from mm -hmm. the home, we do try to seek out relatives. Um, and we are, in LA County, fortunate to be able to place about 50% of our kids um, that do have to be out of the home with relatives. What about parents who, no doubt, may have fallen down on their duties, but fundamentally they love their children, and is there a way to get that child back into that home? Yes, that's always, if we do remove a child from their home, right. from their parents, our first priority is to try to reunify them back right. with their, their family. And is that done through parenting classes, through social worker support, through nonprofit support? Sort of a little bit of everything. Okay. It depends what the need um, right. is in the family that actually brought the child to our attention. Right. Um, so it may be parenting classes, it may be rehab um, right. to help the parent um, it's techniques and, to parent. And do you find that we can be successful with those reunifications? Yes, fortunately we okay. are able to reunify a lot of, of families. And, and we, when we do reunify them, we provide services for a while to make right. sure it's stable before we uh, get now, out of the picture. When reunification is not possible and a family member is not in the county or nearby, talk to us about the process of fostering and then potential adoption. Well, that is one of our biggest needs. Right. We, we want to keep kids in their community. If we, are, if we have right. to remove them from their families, we'd still like them to not have to switch schools. Of course. And, so we try to keep them in the community. So it's very important for, for members of the community to look at becoming foster parents so that they can help um, take care of a child or children while we're trying to reunify them with a the parent. Um, in the event that we are, aren't successful, if the family's not able to be um, reunited and reunified and the kids need a more permanent home, we'd obviously need, whether it's foster, those same right. foster families or perhaps other families that are only looking to adopt. How can we become a foster family? By all means, give us a call. Right, um, because there are some folks that, you know, in the depth of their core, they feel like fostering is their purpose. They, they don't want to adopt. It's not their goal, but they just, they really have that gift. Yes. And we need more families like mm -hmm. that. We unfortunately end up placing too many children out of their area, mm -hmm. out of their community, even out of the county. Oh, really? Um, because we don't have the resources here to be able to place them, keep them in their community. And then in terms of adoption, it's a more lengthy process, but I presume there are children available from all age ranges? Yes, there are children from all age ranges who we are no longer able to be working towards reunification for right. whatever reason, and those children need permanency. So we are actively, always actively looking for um, families to adopt well, thank you for well. really taking care of our children. We really appreciate it. His name is Brian Miller. He is with Los Angeles County's Department of Children and Family Services. My name is Brad Pomerantz. You're joining us from the San Gabriel Valley on Local Edition.